Good morning. Oh my gosh. I feel like I'm running late today, but I needed my coffee and I have my priorities. Not gonna lie. Top priority. Happy hump day. It is Wednesday, right? I'm not lying. No, we're good. Okay. Today's not brought to you by a blank mug. I would never do that to you. Today's the mom mug. I'm missing my daughter today, big time. Missing her big time today. I won't talk about it much because I'll get upset, but I'm really missing my girl. So, that mug was fitting. Good morning, Melanie. Look, I'm already starting to tear up. Good morning, Coop. <gasps> I can wave back at you. <gasps> That's new. <gasps> Carla, too. Oh my gosh. I can wave back at you guys. Okay. I'm so sorry. Good morning, Coop. Good morning, Carla. I know, first thing this morning, I'm already like all emotional. Popping in to say, hi, super busy, but I got a notification you were on, so I had to say good morning. Oh, that's super awesome, Michelle. Thank you for that. You waved at all of us. That is so awesome. That, um, that feature is new. That wasn't there yesterday. That was good. I needed, I needed that to get my mind off of that. Ugh. I just... Um, yeah, I'm missing my daughter right now. Okay, so we better get busy. Because I'm a, uh, it's 30, 6, 7. Okay, we better get busy. I am, did not even introduce myself. Um, I'm Carmen Frank. I am an Orange Status presenter with Unique. I am not a makeup artist. I'm just a girl who loves makeup and sharing the tips and tricks I've learned along the way. Good morning, Valerie. Oh, look. <laughs> I love that feature. It's 8.07 there. Oh, so yeah, yeah, we are, we leave for school about like 7.10. Well, we're supposed to. Since my lives have been going over, we've been leaving a little bit later. But, all right, we're going to start, um, we're going to start off with our rose water toning spritz. That's going to help balance the pH of your skin, help with any redness. It just is very refreshing. <coughs> Today's look, um, I am going to do, I think, like a very neutral eye. So I am finally totally out of my instant lifting serum. I'm very sad because I'm the biggest dork ever because I think I forgot to order it. I'm pretty sure I did. So, but we'll survive. We will survive. We will survive. Isn't there a song, I will survive? Okay, so we're gonna move on to our Touch Glorious Primer. Today's eye look is gonna be brought to you by Shimmer. And this is the reason why. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna invite her to this. So one of our, one of my beautiful viewers ordered, um, ah, thank you for sharing. Thank you for the reminder, Miss Carla. Um, thank you to my replay viewers that are gonna be watching later on this replay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to share this video. Sharing is caring. If you share this video, be sure to comment shared because I give back in my VIP group. If you are not in my VIP group, comment VIP and we will get you added. So touch Glorious Primer. It's going to be the most amazing thing on your face. It's awesome. It's, you're going to feel like satiny soft, but it's going to help keep your makeup on all day. And it simply is just amazing. It's going to fill in all the fine lines and wrinkles. It's awesome. So today's look brought to you by Shimmer. Um, I have a beautiful longtime friend. Oh my gosh. Her and I have known each other. I think we met each other right after we had kiddos when our spouses were working together. And she brought a shimmer. And what she noticed yesterday is she's having a lot of fallout. So we're going to talk about that today. Yes, I normally put on uplift first. But I'm going to use the nice word. If you can only imagine what I would normally call myself not on live, public. 
Facebook Live. Um, I'm a dork, and I think I put it in my cart, and I believe I did not place that order, and I think I did not order it. I'm so great about ordering everybody else's products that need, they need me to do, and then it comes to ordering mine, and it's like, durr. So yes, normally we do uplift first, Carla. Good morning, Karen. Okay, I love that wave feature. Okay, let's get going. So we, I did not use my uplift today. So I did use the Touch Glorious Primer. I know you're saying, girl, on this, I don't know why I do that. Like, but it's okay. As long as I'm getting everybody else's products ordered for them, like they need, that's really all that matters. I, I can lack on my part for me. So I am using, right now my skin is still kind of dry. I'm still kind of between seasons. So I'm using the BB cream. I have found that the honey and the bisque have a happy marriage and they work really good on my face. So these are the colors I'm using right now. <gasps> crystal, crystal. So let me tell you something last night. Last night, I reached over and I grabbed my little roller. And I put the sleepy time behind the big toe, like you said, and I used it on the bottom of my foot, <coughs> like you said. I forgot to take my melatonin. Remember we decided we were gonna try this on a weekend? This girl forgot to take her melatonin. I was too tired to get up out of bed, so I did not get up out of bed. And guess who slept amazing? This girl. I did. I slept so good. So thank you so much for my sleepy time roller. It was the bomb.com. And it is part of my new sleepy routine. I can't wait till my order comes in. It is on its way. I love it. Okay, so we're just going to take the baby cream. I mixed the two shades right here in the corner of my little makeup mirror. This um, this was essential oils, and she made me a roller because she's awesome like that. And so she actually made me four, made my sister six, made me four, and I used the sleepy time. I've also used the headache one, and... Um, I've got an allergy one and a chill pill. Taking that to work today. I needed it yesterday. I needed it yesterday at work. So I'm now gonna take my powder concealer brush. Yes, my powder concealer brush. The most amazing brush we have. No, I lied. These are the two most amazing brushes that <clears throat> are life right now. Yeah, I love essential oils. I mean, I just finished drinking some of them right now. Every morning I have um, a drop of peppermint, grapefruit, and lemon inside my ice water after my apple cider vinegar and cranberry juice shot. I do shots in the morning. I'm cool like that. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I do that every single morning. So, I get it in. I love I have to get ready for a pop-up. I'm so glad I have. Oh, have a great Wednesday, Miss Crystal. <laughs> Hello, Mark. Okay, I'm loving that wave feature. I can't wait till Kelly sees it. That must have been like an update last night because that was not there yesterday. We all should do shots in the morning. <laughs> I mean, I prefer maybe some fireball shots. Just saying. Okay. So we're just going to blend that in. Make sure we blend down the neck. I'm going to move a little bit faster today just because it took me a little while to get started because I was waiting for the coffee to brew. Like I said, we got priorities. Priorities. All right, we're going to use some setting powder. Good morning, Laura. Laura, beautiful face. Made it on my lookbook yesterday. You have to go check out my Facebook wall and go... Head on over to my website and give that girl a heart. 
It was so nice to put someone else on there besides myself. So if you ever use, have a unique look that you're using our unique products for your look, please send me what you used. Send me your pictures. It was so exciting to do it. It really made my heart happy. So thank you, Laura. Coffee then makeup. Exactly. You got it right, Carla. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Coffee coffee is coffee is my one of my loves. Absolutely, Carla. If you're using unique makeup and you're doing a unique look um, from our products, I should start doing that on a regular basis. Post them in my VIP. If you post them in my VIP and list the products you use, I'm going to do that. That's exactly what I'm going to do. We decided right now. Right. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. So I have a little concealer left over right there. So we're going to use that up. All right. So I'm going to use my little foundation brush because I found that that is what works best for me. Oh, thank you for sharing, Laura. It is nice to have made it there. Aw. It was nice to put you there. Like, it really made my heart happy. And I don't know, Laura, did you click on the link and go to my lookbook and see it? I put your words that you said in it. Okay. So we're just going to first... As always, I'm going to apply this right under my eye. We're going to drag it down. We're going to kind of go in a little triangle here. And then we're going to just let that sit for a few minutes and let it kind of warm up and diffuse into the, into the skin. I need to sneeze. <laughs> it's an older picture, but all you need, girl, list your products and I'll share it. I love that. Okay, so now we're going to do... The Kelly contour technique. Now, I think yesterday I went a little too low on my nose. And then we're going to go from the, the uh, peak of the brow all the way over to the other peak of the brow. I cannot wait till my con uh, contour stick comes in. I am totally excited for that. That is um, going to be amazing. And I watched the video again yesterday, and I'm like, oh my gosh, it's like even I can manage. So I'm pretty excited about that. Good morning, Jennifer. Oh, good, Laura, I'm glad. Good morning, Kelly. Kelly, did you see this new feature that that we on the live can wave at people? Flip and love that. Okay. So we have got that all on. So we've got our concealer in the places that we want it to go. We're using it here as our contour. But what's even more exciting is we get that contour stick in this week. And it is going to be amazing. Kelly, I absolutely love this little trick you did with the um, with making like the cross. Like, I love that. So see, look, I do the sign of the cross on here. And then I do my, my blessing at the end with the sign of the cross. Love that. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm first going to start out because my con uh, concealer side is fresh because it's got no product on it right now. I'm going to buff underneath my eyes first. So Kelly, let me ask you a question cuz normally like I do that we do this concealer under the eyes and that's like what works. Um I don't feel like I really have dark circles underneath and I saw the way they used it they used the lighter underneath for underneath the eyes. Do you plan to do the same or are you still going to do your contour uh this, you know, routine that we have? Good morning, Miss Shelby. Okay. So look at that brightness going on right there. Really bright and underneath the eye. So what I mentioned before is I'm going to do kind of a neutral eye look today, but I'm going to use the shimmers because I have a friend that ordered her first quad 
and she noticed with the shimmer she had some fallout. So we're going to talk about how to apply the shimmers today. Kelly, I was going to call you about that or message you about that, but I think I think I can actually manage today. I think. I think. We'll see. I'm going to try to do all of my highlight and contour with the stick. Okay. That's what I want to know. <coughs> it looks super duper easy. So I'm kind of stoked about that. So, okay, we're just going to blend it in a little bit with the brush. And then we're going to come in with the, um, with our beauty blender. I almost always apply shimmer with a wet brush on my finger. Yeah, there's definitely different ways. Even when, um, <clears throat> excuse me. When we came out with the anniversary palette, all right, so I've got my damp beauty blender. We're just gonna dab that in there. When we came out with the um, anniversary palette and it had the micro glitters, um, I remember Kelly doing a little tutorial with us about how to apply those because if you just swipe them on like regular eyeshadow, you're not gonna get those micro glitters. You, we were actually using our um, cream shadow brush and you know, doing it a little bit different way. Wet brush, I can definitely see that happening. So I'm gonna show her the way that um, I normally just do it. I am gonna try the wet way, and then I know the finger thing works because I have used that a lot. Okay, so we buffed underneath the eyes. So now I'm gonna take my little piece of tissue and I'm gonna dab, dab. Good morning, Ashley. I don't know if I said good morning yet, but I didn't wave at you. Now I did. I love that little feature. I gotta make sure that's not a distracting, a distraction for me. Okay. So we're just gonna dab away, and then we're gonna take our itty bitty beauty blender I feel like my little tank top is shimmering down. Good morning, Marlena. I don't know if Kelly has gotten hers in, Laura. Um, Cause I know hers, uh, so we're not gonna take our beauty blender and we're just gonna dab it all the way out. I know her mail takes longer, her shipments take longer to get. She ordered it before me though, because I, was questioning if I was gonna be capable of managing it. Like, I was worried. I'm like, am I gonna be able to do this? <laughs> Living in Nowheresville, North Dakota. Look how bright underneath my eyes look. Just because I put a little bit of lighter concealer under there. Okay, so I'm totally, just dab it in, work it in. Make sure you go right underneath the eye. All right, people, moving on. Be sure if you are tuning in to say hi, tell me where you're watching from. Thank you so much for watching. If you are a replay viewer, thank you for watching. You guys, be sure to share this video. Sharing is caring. I will also get you entered for share benefits. Subliminal messages. <clears throat> okay, moving on to our busy woman's contour. <coughs> <clears throat> oh my goodness. <clears throat> These allergies are no when no. I'm from Texas. Sorry. Oh, no worries, Carla. All right, just cleaning off my brush here. Using my blusher brush and the contour. We're just going to swipe down. Sharing being put in dry. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so we are just gonna press this right underneath our cheekbone. And I remember Kelly saying this week, go back into the ear. Kelly, do I normally go, like I usually go from right here back. Is that like where I should be going? Kelly is my makeup teacher. She's my mentor, she's my makeup mentor. <clears throat> there is benefits to sharing. And you gotta be in my VIP group. So if you are not in my VIP group and you wanna be, 
Be sure to comment VIP and I will get you added. I just realized my mirror's not on. I'm a little slow this morning, can you tell? All right. Okay, now we're gonna go up and we're gonna hit right up in here. It doesn't let me share on my end. Are you watching from um, the stories? I remember our friend Laura said, if you watch from the stories, you cannot share from there. You have to go from like the notification to the wall and do it. Okay, and then if you wanna hit your gobbler, just be sure just to hit the like shaded area right here. Just hit right under the, sh the chin and right in there. You don't want to go down the neck. Then we're going to hit our nose and then we will move on to our three and our E. Okay, we're going to pinch and do the tip. Okay, from hairline right to under the outer corner of the eye. Oh, so then I do it right. I good. I'm a good student. Okay, so now we're gonna do our three and E. I had to do extra curly on my hair today because we're going out to dinner tonight and I don't wanna have to do it again tonight. All right. See, it doesn't take much. Look at that. Nice and chiseled. I, I got this new hair growth that's been there for a while and it's kinda, it's weird. It's being weird. Okay. Finished with our busy woman's contour. Now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take seductive and I'm gonna very lightly press it into my brush and go right above. Now I was doing it totally different and wrong and then again, working with Kelly on our last, I think one of our last videos because I always feel like I need to go like this and go in the ball of my cheek, my apple of my cheeks. But we're just gonna put it right above there. Okay. Um, I do not know if you are not. I usually do not just automatically peep, add people in unless you ask for it. So, um, I will, I forgot you were going to dinner. Yeah, we're going to dinner. Trying a new place too that, I mean, we've lived in the area for six years and um, I just realized I did not put my my 3D mascara down in here. So we're gonna get her going. Yeah, so we're trying a new place. Totally excited. We do not hardly ever go out to dinner. Um, I mean, we like get stuff on Fridays, but not like go out to dinner, especially with like friends. So it's different for us. So, okay. I, the one thing I did not do, Kelly, you're supposed to be my secretary. You're supposed to be my Bob. You're my Bob, Kelly, is we're gonna take our brush and we're gonna get that line of demarcation. Make sure we don't have those lines going down there. And I know I need to get my nose good. All right. Now we're moving on to brows. How are we doing on time? Gotta make sure I'm getting done in an orderly fashion today. <coughs> so you guys, my friend Kelly and I, I feel like this is a good time since you're on Kelly. Blend till your fingers hurt, I know. I know, that's one thing, blend, 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 blend. And look at that hair, like it really, I'm sorry that I'm distracted by it. We all need a bob, we all need a bob in our life, we do. All right, get your life together, Carmen, let's go. Um, ah, I was like, I forgot what I was gonna say. So I'm gonna start out with, I'm using the Brow Obsession palette. I'm holding it upside down. We're gonna start off with the dark and we're gonna do our lining out and then our, our wing and then we'll move on. Um, so Kelly and I, a few, we've done a couple of lives together, but after this last live, we got like, seriously, we got requests to do more. So Kelly and I, what we did decide to do, because I think they're like, we do have moments like today, and it could be a little bit different, like if you had someone more glamour to go to. Um, we do like have to do our makeup in the morning, and then when we go out in the evening, if we have, you know, a work event or whatever, you need to take your 
your look, unless you like starting over from scratch, y'all know I'm lazy. I don't want to redo all that. But we all need to take our looks from day to night. So what's going to happen on Friday, <clears throat> and we're probably going to need to start a little bit earlier than normal, maybe like at 545. Have to see if that's good for Kelly. We Kelly is going to hop on my live. You're going to have a little double trouble on Friday. Kelly is going to come on my live in the morning, and we are going to do a day look. And then we are going to come back in the evening <clears throat> at 7 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. Is it 9 o'clock Central Standard Time for you, Kelly? Maybe if you can drop the times in the comments. But we'll also post about it. But we are then going to take the day look to the night look together. So you got double trouble, double time on Friday. Lucky y'all. This, this here, this palette makes it very easy. <clears throat> okay, cool. Yeah, the times confuse me, I know. Okay. I'm actually happy with that little piece today. She gets taken care of Monday, I think. Okay. 6 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, 8 a.m. Oh, you know what? And John is off. He can maybe help with Bub. Okay, so we got our bottom line done. Now we're going to come in with the number one shade. And we're going to brush it in here. I'm just going to go the way... My hair's going on there. And then we're going to brush it down. <gasps> yeah, I'm excited. Well, I'm excited, but here's what she did. This is how slick Kelly is. She's like, now, Carmen, you're going to tell me what we're going to do in the morning. And I'm like, Ugh, what? So she's making me take the lead in the morning. I mean, we both kind of do our makeup the same. If you watch us, and I know several of you... Um, especially like Laura, you watch us both. Um, I definitely follow her lead because she's amazeballs. So, I mean, we'll do kind of our makeup the same, but I'm going to lead the eye look, so I'm scared. Okay, so be sure to brush that up and out. Okay. Looking good, looking good. Don't worry about that right there. We're gonna fix that when we're, when we're done. There we go, okay. We're gonna come in with the light again. We're gonna do this side. Remember, you wanna go the, the way of your, the way your, uh, the little hairs grow. Your brow lashes, your brow lashes. Did I just say that? My brow lashes. Yes, go the way of your brow lashes. I did tell you I was not a makeup artist, so see, I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, Lord. It's been that kind of week, guys. So I like to follow, the reason I comb my brows down is I like to follow my natural brow line. So that's why I comb them down, so I can go right there across the top. And then I, I always seem like I forget to kind of brush in that color. <clears throat> Brow lashes, golly. I should have had the hot mess the hot mess mug today. I tell ya. you, you ever just have one of those weeks that are like kind of crazy, but not kind of crazy, but good. Ah. Yes, and I did figure up, yeah, okay. Remind me, if I don't, message me. Like, even go right now and pop me a message because then that will remind me to, to message you back because I'm that, I'm just crazy. Not that I'm crazy, well, kinda. We all know that. Okay, so see, see how I don't have to worry about that? I just take that little brush, swipe away. And there goes those little marks. 
this brow this brow artist brush I tell you what it is amazing and what I've really been liking doing too is just taking this and giving it just like a quick little swipe now we're gonna come in with the wax remember a little goes a long way you don't need much our lashes now eye hairs <laughs> I don't know I'm having are they, do they just call them brow hairs I'm kind of having one of those I'm not gonna say blonde moments because I don't want to offend anyone. My mom tells me I should have been blonde because sometimes I say some really dumb things just because I'm not thinking. I think before I talk, probably. But I'm okay with that. I keep them entertained. <laughs> I hears. That's like the time I couldn't remember what nostrils were called. <laughs> <laughs> brow hairs nose holes <laughs> I love it okay so brows done oh but that one nose holes oh my god that's hilarious okay coffee break you guys crack me up I needed that this morning though I really did because this morning first thing on my live I start getting emotional because I went with my mom mug and I'm missing Kara. So I really, really needed that laugh and that distraction. That was good. Oh, hilarious. Okay. Let's luminize, people. But I do that all the time. Like, I will just draw a blank on what something is called. And, like, totally forget what it is. So, okay. So we're using our Benevolent... A la mode powder luminizer. I did too, Carmen Girl. I've been emotional today. I needed a laugh. Oh, that's awesome. I'm glad you I'm glad we were able to bring that to your morning girl. And I don't know why. I mean, I know it's been a couple weeks since we've seen um since we've seen our daughter. And I know she's feeling the same way too, because <clears throat> she FaceTimed me last night. She was wearing my sweater, and I know. When she wears that sweater, she is missing home and missing me. And it was. And it's like, yeah, like two weeks is kind of, because gosh, the last time we saw her was Easter. Has it been? Yeah. So it's been like two weeks. So yeah, we're, we're our missing stage. Okay. We're going to do the nose and do right above. Um, Carla, I loved the hacks video you posted. I need to go watch it because um, I was trying to fall asleep last night and I was looking at some on Pinterest and then I saw that. So I need to go watch that. I love little hacks. That's where I learned my, um, gosh, I got my, that's where I learned my, um, oh, how I do the X on my liner on my lips is from one of those hacks. So, Okay. Let's go on to the eyes. I am using the A La Mode, A La Mode Powder Illuminizer. And it comes in, I want to say th three or more shades. But this is Benevolent. So there's another one that's lighter. Oh, there you go. I'm trying to find a good, a good spot where you can kind of see what it looks like. There you go. Can you see that? That's probably a good a good angle. I love it. This is the first time I've ever used a highlighter. <clears throat> what? All of a sudden, I was hearing Kara Lewis Newton's voice on your live. Oh, uh, was it you that posted it in the Rock Me Fabulous or someone else there? I don't know who posted it in the Rock Me Fabulous group, but it was really good. Oh, girl, this fan brush is life. I could just sit here and close my eyes and just do that. Like, it's it's relaxing. Probably need the lighter one. Yeah, there is a lighter one. <clears throat> I don't recall the name, though. Oh, maybe it was. But can you tell me... Okay, this is... What does M-O-D mean? Because I was thinking makeup of the day, but then I'm like, I don't, that would be two O's. I, I, I know, I, I'm like, what does M-O-D mean? And I didn't want to be dumb and ask. Dumb. 
That is weird. Oh, moderator. Dur, dur, dur. Never would have thought of that, honestly. <laughs> okay. So I am trying to decide what lip color to go with today. So obviously I kind of want to go, I'm going to go with a neutral eye. These are the colors that I'm trying to decide between the lips. I'm trying to decide between a pompous lip liner, the sensual liquid lipstick, or the sentimental liquid lipstick. Those are my options. So I'm doing a neutral eye. Okay, good. I'm, not, I'm glad I'm not the only one. So I'm going to do a shimmer today because I want to show um, how... To apply the shimmers because I have a friend that just got her orders and yesterday she noticed some fallout so sentimental sentimental is that the really which one is a sentimental I haven't used that one in a while let's do it let's do it do it and then we'll use the popper lip liner on there because I think we can I think we can get away with it if I do it light enough okay Central, I love you in a dark lip. Sentimental can be dark. Why don't we do this? I'll swatch them on my hand and then we could decide. It'll be a vote. We'll head to head. Laura versus Carla. What lip is Carla gonna use? Okay, so let's put on a little bit of eye primer. <clears throat> it's so funny because I get scared to wear a this is how crazy my mind works. You guys are going to get a little piece of what goes on in my brain and how ridiculous it is. Why well, I just have such a hard time. It's because, I mean, I've talked about my social anxiety that I have. I've been kind of open about that, I think, for the most part. And I, um, I always feel like I'm going to wear these dark lips and then I'm like going to go to work and like everyone's gonna be like, oh my god, did you see Carmen and her dark lips? You know, that's my mind. That's where my mind goes. Good morning, beautiful Ember. Good morning, Laura. She's a little makeup phobe. I am. I, I, just it's ridiculous. I mean, it, it's not ridiculous because having anxiety is not ridiculous. But like, um, what is it? My therapist used to say, like, I have irrational fear. It's like when I used to fear when, you know, the way my dishwasher was loaded. Like I was the only one that could load the dishwasher. And it's like, I remember her saying like, Carmen, what's going to happen if it's not loaded right? Well, nothing's going to happen, but it just ain't going to be right. You know, so it's like I had this fear, you know, so now it comes down to lips. I'm putting, you know, scared to wear this lip because, oh my gosh. People, you know, are going to be seeing me. And it's like, irrational. <laughs> I know that in my head. <laughs> How are you with lipstick? Good morning, Amber. All right. So you guys know, I, I don't even think I said, because I was too busy blabbing my mouth, is I am using the Victoria's Cream Shadow. Y'all know, if you've watched Kelly and I at all, we use that like every single day. Be sure it will be on Friday's Double Trouble. All right. So we got a nice clean base. I've always worn bold lipsticks and I was absolutely terrified to try nudes. Then I tried them and loved them. So you were just the opposite. Isn't that funny? Not funny how our minds work. Okay. So I'm definitely going to use Astute as my transition color. Because I do have a little bit of browns inside <coughs> my shirt. <clears throat> good morning, Miss Katie. You're so backwards. Backwards can be good. I add a short three-letter word in front of backwards. Two S's, maybe a vowel. That's what I like to say. All right, so we're going to come in with our... We're going to clean up a little bit here. 
All right, we're gonna come in with our blending brush. Good morning, Mark. All right, so we're just gonna tap our amazing blending brush and we're just gonna use it right under here. I don't even really know what I'm doing yet. Maybe we'll bring in some other browns, I don't know. I'm just going with it. All right, this is like the most amazing transition color. So if you don't have this on your palette, you need to get it. It's astute, it's amazeballs. Good morning, Miss Shannon. Bass backwards, pretty close. Subtract that B, I can do that math. Just kidding, I'm actually doing math really good right now. I'm pretty darn proud of myself. <laughs> I have always been, like, I hated math. And then I've been having to do uh, a little bit of third grade math. And then we moved from fourth and now we're in sixth grade math. And I, it's the first time in my entire life that I feel I'm doing good in it. Is that not crazy? Thanks to Chris Andrade. She is our sixth grade math teacher. So shout out to Chris Andrade. Okay. I got to go in here and watch, read some of these. <gasps> Popping in to say, hi. Hi. Did you, Shannon, did you see my post I made last night about my father-in-law? I went to text you and forgot because Kara FaceTimed us. <clears throat> He's home. I don't know if you saw it. I have started wearing bolder colors, but I'm terrible about reapplying it. So I end up with a nude lip. So I'm terrible about reapplying too. That's why I carry a bonbon. I take the lazy way out. How are we doing on time? 647. I got a boogie, boogie, boogie. Everybody's fave transition color. It is because it is an amazing transition color. You're so sarcastic today. I love it. Am I really? More than usual? Because I'm, my husband says my name, my middle name should have been sarcastic. Good morning, Chris. Yeah, he is finally home. <coughs> Thanks, big glad. Me too. I will message you with a little more details. I don't want to put that all on here. Yeah, the bon bon, that's cool. Okay, I don't know really what I'm doing today. Let's pull out. Oh, thank you, Carla. Not the one I wanted. Good morning, Miss Jamie. <gasps> Look, I'm going to wave at you. All right. <clears throat> All right, so I'm going to grab palette one. So we used Astute. I'm going to grab this chipper, and I'm gonna, that's going to be like an, a lid shade. And then I'm going to bring in the exhilarated shimmer over it. So we can kind of talk about how we apply that. <sighs> my hubby says I'm going to get my butt kicked one day because of my mouth. Yeah. You know, sometimes people just got to hear what we got to say. I have a very loud laugh, so they always tell me, oh my gosh, mom, you're so embarrassing. So I'm going to come in with the chipper. I'm just lightly putting it on my brush, and then we're just going to lightly put it on the lid. Okay, and I feel like I'm gonna, I'm not gonna bring it like all the way down to the lash line, but I'm going lower than the crease. <clears throat> exactly, Kelly. Kelly, we're only 29, woman. You two keep getting this wrong. You keep telling everybody our secrets. We are only 29. Ooh, I did this one darker than I should have. Oh, well. We're just gonna blend it, blend it down. Don't be scared. I mean, I'm normally scared, but we're just gonna blend it down some. I've gotta look and see because I feel like, um, because the screen is on backwards, I get confused. So I have to be careful or I'll be applying to the same dang eye. <laughs> I 
What is 2995 plus tax? Did I miss something? Oh, I get what you mean. <laughs> That's good. Okay. I love that. So I'm going to go ahead real quick while I have the chipper out, and I'm going to use my angled shadow brush, and I'm going to grab some of that, and I'm going to use that as my lower liner. Do I need to turn that a little bit? Blend, blend, blend. That's right. We're going to do some more blending in just a moment. Just going to bring some of that chipper right underneath the eye. Got to find a better angle. I feel like I can't see all that great right here. You can also stamp it. That's also a good way, especially if you're doing it wet. Stamping is, is great. And then I always like to use the bottom part of the brush and just give it a swipe and kind of soften it up. And call it good. So we used chipper down there. I feel like I've got more on this corner, so we're going to just dab a little bit. Okay, and then we'll blend it. And don't forget your white liner. That's right. So before we add the shimmer... I'm gonna clean off my brush and then I'm gonna I'm gonna blend some more. I'm just gonna blend it really good. Windshield wiper. I feel like we're doing a dance because we can like do our swirls and then we can windshield wiper. We're just gonna blend, blend, blend. And you could not ask for a more better blending brush. Like it is amazing. Now, if you feel like sometimes like me that you get a little carried away with bringing it down here. Remember, you still have some concealer left. So grab it and clean up around here. If that's, cause I know sometimes I feel that way. And look at that. See how it helps? Just really helps clean up that line. So if you need to do that, do that. Okay. When it comes to, you know what, Carla, I will do that and just because <clears throat> I don't want to forget. We're going to bring that out right now. Then we got to get moving. Um, there we go. When it comes to adding the shimmer, this is what I like to do. You can kind of do one or two ways. And I'm going to show you... Oh, here it is. Okay. We're going to talk about this. One... You can use <laughs> you can use the blending brush, and then we're gonna kind of just like tap it. We're not gonna like swipe. We're just gonna tap it in, and then you can either like tap it on your eyelid like this, which you see me do a lot. But if you're like dusting it on, it is you're gonna have some fallout. You can also use this, which is what I like to do, and we're gonna use our angled shadow brush and we're going to use the sponge side and then we're going to just kind of pack it on the brush so I just kind of press my brush in it and press it a little bit and then this is what I'm going to do right now so you can use the blending brush if that's what you have or that's what you like and you can use that and kind of just press it in what I like to do is I press it into my sponge side I tap my brush off on the side of the palette to help. Absolutely. I am a blower or a tap on the side. You can do either one. That's a, it just, I kind of, you know, you just automatically do things like tap, tap. I press it in. You kind of want to just press it in there. Just by laying it down there and just kind of press it in where you want it to go. Okay. You can also use your finger and just tap, press it in. Okay, look at the difference between those two eyes. Holy moly. Now, I want to make sure that I go all the way down to my lash line because I'm going to actually come in and blend that in. They are always going to have a little fallout. Now, one thing you can do too, 
and we'll talk about that in just a moment after I finish this eye, is like before, I always, and I will probably go back, who knows, is I like putting my under eye concealer on after I do my shadows because if I do have fallout, usually it just comes off after I do, um, see, I just tapped on the side. So yeah, that's what I do. Um, because if you do that, then you can get any fallout that is down there comes off. You can also, if you have a setting powder, you can like lightly pack the setting powder on the lid. I mean, on your, your lower eye. And then when you're all done doing your sh shimmers and shadows, just simply wipe it away. But doing the shadow this way, I just don't feel like I have fallout. So that's, um, that's what I do. I just press it. You can also just take your finger and press it on there too. <clears throat> but always, if you do it, just be sure to tap your brush, pack it on the brush, lay it on there, or use your finger. Those are some great tips. Also, if you make the brush, if you wet the brush, it will make the shimmers pop more. I like to wet my brush with the loose shadows. Absolutely, I used to. Well, you can kind of see is spray inside my rose water lid and do that. I haven't done that for a long time. Maybe we need to try that, like on a night look. <sighs> okay, so I'm going to clean my blending brush off really good and then we're gonna blend. I'm just kind of going right there above the lid. You can see where the focus is just to bend there and I'm gonna kind of just leave that pop color there. Thank you guys so much for joining. I feel like I haven't said thank you in in a hot minute. So thank you guys for joining. Feel free to share this video. If you share it, be sure to comment, share it. <clears throat> I like to give back to my shares that I cannot say publicly because I'll be against compliance and we don't want to do that. So sharing is caring. Just help a sister out. So I'm going to take some more of that exhilarated and I'm gonna bring it even more right here on the inner corner and we're gonna do some little highlight because it makes a difference. Look at the difference between this eye and that eye. You can definitely see it's definitely a pop of color. You wanna open that eye. Especially when your eyes hide behind glasses. <laughs> Thank you for sharing, Amber. Highlight is everything. I never highlighted before. <coughs> Hi, B. Good morning. I didn't even see that pop up. All right, guys. So we are going to grab our white liner. Carla, I'm doing it for you. And we're just going to add a little bit of white liner and help open up our eye a little bit. I never... Now, my... Oh, so... Um, like right now, I can notice I have some fallout right underneath there, but that's okay because I'm going to take this brush, but I also just uh, threw it under there. I don't mind a little shimmer. There we go. There. Carla, that's for you. Today's white liner dedicated to Carla. Okay. Let's clean up, people. Let's move on to eyes. Bryson borrowed, he was working on a surfboard yesterday. He borrowed the blow dryer, but look what he brought back. Okay, I'm gonna warm it up real quick. My eye is watering today. Can we just talk about how naked my eyes look without lashes right now? Look at that. Ooh, can someone snapshot that so I can use it as a picture? Comment, share, and you get entered into a drawing for a chance at some free goodies. <gasps> Thank you, Laura. All right, so we're just gonna pinch, and we're gonna lift. I do still use my torture device because I love it. And because my lashes grow straight out, it drives me insane. So I'm just gonna try and hold it for like, ah, thank you. You, you got me. Thank you so much, Carla. You are awesome. Okay, and then I like to just let it out just a little bit. Usually not that much. I usually don't let all the way go like I just did. 
This eye is really wandering. I'm not sure why. All right. There we go. Look at those. Okay. So we're just going to pinch. We're going to hold for like 50. Ah, oh, thank you guys. You guys rock. Thank you so much. Will you ever do the lash lift again? Will I? Um, I think I would do the lash lift again. Um, but I would probably only go to my friend that does it, Jen Kachansky, and she's into Hatchby. She's the only one I think I would let do it. But I would totally do it again. I mean, my lashes looked amazing. They were curled so good. And she, I, I mean, I trust her. You know, I have, like, I'm always scared to give, you know, control of my eyes to anyone. So, and especially when, you know, they're basically putting, like, some kind of perm solution on it. You're my Tracy, Laura. You made my heart so happy right now. Okay. So, Mama opened herself a new Epic Mascara. The Lash Lift, um, gosh, I did it last summer, I think July, it is perming your lashes. Yes, I did it in July. We did it via Facebook Live. Um, oh, you gotta love a new Epic Mascara. Look how happy she is. <gasps> oh. um, and it was, oh my gosh, look at the difference between yesterday and today. I was like, look at that, people. I'm gonna ask in just a moment, I'm gonna ask for another screenshot. If someone can do that for me, I love you long time. We're going to let that dry for just a moment. <clears throat> You've been super distracted this morning with kids, but I did for sure. You rock. Thank you so much for sharing. Yeah, she is amazing. She is probably the only person. Well, not probably. The word is yes. She is the only person that I would actually trust to do it. Okay, I'm gonna ask for a screenshot in just a second after I get this just how I want it. Okay, I'm trying to get in the middle. Okay. So, fresh tube of mascara is amazing. Not gonna lie. I was getting down to the nitty gritty of my last one. Look at the back. This is the one. I'm trying to give this one some little extra attention because I'm usually pretty fast with her, but she needs some love. <clears throat> Thank you, Carla. You saw the lookbook, Melanie. Did you give her a heart? Isn't that awesome? That really made my night yesterday. See, that's what it's about. That's what it's about. It's about uplifting, val uplifting, uplift, empower, and validating women across the globe. And that's what we did with Laura's beautiful look. And I loved her words when she replied to me yesterday and I saw her words, I'm like, yeah, those are so going in there. It was perfect. Made It really made my day. I'm not going to lie. Okay. We're on the same epic cycle. <laughs> I need to date it. I need to date it though. I need my silver Sharpie. Oh God, that's good. Kelly, that's good. Did you open a new one? That's hilarious. I love that. Well, good, because I don't have any other cycle, so that's awesome. Oh, 705. I've been adding a drop of lavender oil to my mascara to make it last a little bit longer. Ah, I, um, I cannot do lavender. It 
we're using now the 3D mascara and I'm just focusing on my tips. Um, I can't do lavender. For some reason, it just, like, it's just one of those things that doesn't agree with me. Okay, now before I apply the fibers, I'm just gonna comb them out a little bit. I'm gonna twist my brush, roll on the back of my hand, and just focus on the tips here. Okay, in just a moment, I'm gonna ask for another uh, the, 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 the screenshot. You guys are, thank, you guys are my besties for being there for me, taking those pictures. I appreciate it, because I've been wanting to do it, and it's like, how in the world are you supposed to do it when you're on the live? I guess I could just watch and then replay and pause and all that baloney. I should go just do one eye and go to dinner tonight with the one eye done and be like, John's friends will be like, oh, she's a little weird. You're allergic to lavender. Where's Mary Works? That's a great tip, Shannon. Thank you. I'm going to dry this for just a moment. So we're gonna grab our gel. We're gonna gel this side and then we're gonna get, if someone wants to get ready for a screenshot, we're gonna take one more to show the difference between the Epic and then the 3D mascara on the tips. I like to call this right eye right here, I like to call this my triple threat because I use the Lash Serum and then we use the Epic and then the 3D mascara. That's what I call the triple threat. I think it's called something else online, but I don't know. Oh, here, let me settle down my hair. Okay, you guys ready? Okay. All right, let's carry on, carry on. Look at the volume on the baby hair now. I know, gosh dang it. It's so funny. And I always wear, you know, my hair right here in the front area up. Well, because most of the time, you know, I'm working with students leaning over desks and I just cannot stand the hair on my face. That's like every time I go where I'm like, hey, Monica, I'd love some bangs. And she's like, Carmen, do you remember the last time we did that? And they drove you nuts and you had to grow them out and blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, yes, thanks for the reminder. But we are... Changing up my hair color for Friday. I was going to just throw some color all over. But we're doing something. It has to do with the foils. And I can't remember. And she keeps track of the color for me. So she's going to do. Thank goodness she does. I'm just like, you got a full ring, girl. Go for it. Because I have no idea. I'm just like, you go, girl. Just... I trust her. That's You know you trust someone when you're like, go for it, you know? <clears throat> Thank you, Carla. You're the best. All right, we're going to... We're so going to be so late for school today, but it's okay. Well, we're not going to be tardy. I'm just going to have to, like, fight those parents in the drive through line. Then I'm going to be yelling and screaming and cursing at them from my car. My truck. Because that's what I do. Alright. I bet Bryson is in there painting on his surfboard right now. Okay. All done. We're gonna blow dry. You know your lashes are super long when they cast a shadow on your face. Yeah, baby, that's what I want. Absolutely, Shannon, the worst. See, look at the difference between this side. This is my bad eye right now. It's good traffic. Oh, I knew what you meant. When you're at the yellow curb 
and you pull up. So I had to change spots where I dropped Bryson off because I was losing my mind. <gasps> Bye, Laura. Okay, I gotta talk and apply because we're running behind. Where am I? Whoop. Oh, here it is, right in front of your face, Carmen. Um, when you pull up in front of the school or the different area and there's the yellow curbs, don't stop at the don't stop at the back of the yellow curb. Why would you do that? Pull all the way to the front. I don't care if your kid has to walk 20 extra steps. Like, pull up to the front. It's like common sense. Well, one would think. I know I sound like a horrible person right now, but it's really frustrating. Okay. We're using Pompa's lip liner. And we're blending in a little bit of our lip line. That way later, if your lipstick fades, you don't have that strong line. Okay? All right. Now we're just gonna slap on this liquid lipstick. Don't you neglect that troubled, is it look really bad? Look at it. That one's always trouble. And it, it's really because uh, I had a really big shedding this year with that eye, like I've never had before. That blind kid has arrived. <laughs> Anthony, don't look at my left eye today. My lashes, or my right eyelashes look amazing. So I'm using Sentimental today. Look at lipstick. Okay. What blind joke is this kid gonna have for us today? Uh oh. Okay. So got a little boo boo there, but that's okay. That's okay. Because I'm gonna take my concealer brush. Look at that. Didn't even have to add any extra concealer. That's what I love about this fan, that concealer brush. All good, I think. All good? No, Carmen. Okay. I'm surprised Bryson hasn't come in and been like, Mom, Mom, time to go. Okay, I can't see either of your long lashes. <laughs> oh, Anthony. Okay, guys, um, I gotta get going. Oh, we can't forget to. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching. We're gonna do our little setting spray. Sign of the cross. You guys have a great day. I will be back here tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. ish. Um, be sure I will not be live tonight, but be sure to stay tuned Friday for tr Double Trouble with Kelly and I. We're going to be on at 6 a.m. She's going to be on with me, and we're going to go from day, and then tomorrow, uh, Friday night at 7, we're going to be online with her, Double Trouble. My son is awake. Have a great day. Finish spray. Thank you, Kelly. I almost forgot my blessing. Um, you guys have a great day. I think that's all I wanted to say. Bye. Peace out.